What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Good to see you. I feel like I look so cool right now. I got like the sun right behind me. I got my sunglasses on. I got my cool jacket on. And I just finished lunch at Subway. Heck yes! It's a good day. I almost went to Yum Yum, but instead I went to Subway. Eat fresh. Not sponsored. Just, I like Subway. Always go for the $5 footlongs. Get more bang for your buck that way. Cause like the sandwich, the six inch is like, and we're crossing the street now. The six inch is like three or four dollars already. So you're gonna get twice that much for less than twice the cost. So yeah, might as well. Don't get hit by a car. So yeah, might as well get it. Oh, look, we're standing in the sunlight now. It's so crazy. Oh, clear, we can cross. All right, so I wanted to say hello. I'm trying to get into a rhythm with the vloggings. Oh, there's a car coming. Hurry up. I'm not hurrying at all. I wanted to get into a rhythm with the vloggings. I'm going to try and vlog around 11 a.m. or noon, my time, when I go to lunch, wherever I go to lunch, however I get food, because I need to put it in my belly somehow. I haven't been eating enough. Since my birthday, I've just been off my schedule. It's been crazy, probably because I had a crazy birthday, because I stayed up until like 5 a.m. talking. So I need to like get my life back under control and I've been working on it. I'm almost there. I'm like 90% there. But uh, also it's part of this whole like get myself up to speed with my life. Uh, since I've gone independent and I have time now. I feel like the glasses are too douchey. I can't. I can't do it. I'm not that far gone yet. Let's go stand over here. and this is There's more sunshine over this way. Uh, one and two. Oh yeah. I feel like... I can't, I can't think and cross the street at the same time. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Oh, there's a car right there. See, that's how close like, I just got to getting killed. I'm not even driving this time. I'm trying to get my whole life up to speed with being an independent YouTuber and whatnot. I've got lots of projects I want to do, a lot of home improvement kind of stuff. I just put up the sound paneling that I bought at New Year's, around New Year's. Two months late for getting that up. And I want to put up some china balls in my room for lighting. Improved, increased lighting or mood lighting. I found that when songwriting, it really helps if you put yourself in a good mood or good environment for doing whatever it is. If it's, you know, depends on what kind of song you're writing, but it really helps to open yourself up to that kind of vibe. And a lot of the professional songwriters, I've been watching their videos. They do a lot with mood lighting and, and scenery and environment, getting in the right vibe. So I got these china balls that I used to have up in my room when I was living with Kurt and those guys. And uh, my bedroom currently needs more lighting, so I might as well put that up, you know. It's a win-win situation. But I'm really, I'm, I'm like... I'm stuck a little bit on that because I need to put more light up, but I don't know if this is the kind of light I want. So I'm like, well, where, you know, where should I put it? Should I put it in the corners? Should I put it in all the corners? Should I put it in just some of them? And uh, I tweeted this last night, but I have this um, Samuel L. Jackson voice that comes into my head when I'm debating too much on something and I can't decide. And he's not the he's not the super angry Samuel L. Jackson, he's kind of the like Man you gotta just you gotta do what you gotta do. And like kinda like advising. I don't wanna do it right now because there's people around walking their dogs. And I'd feel even weirder trying to imitate imitate Samuel L. Jackson. But you get the picture. There's a voice in my head that I talk to. No, that talks to me when I hesitate too long on something. And I'm gonna walk down this alleyway because I feel really weird walking around the... with people around me and vlogging. So I think I'm just gonna do it. You know, this voice in my head is just like, dude, just do it. Stop waiting, stop trying to think it through and just put, the, put up the lights, you know? So, so what if it's not perfect? You'll fix it later, but you're not gonna know until you put it up. 
It's like that with a lot of things in life. You're not going to know until you try. You know, maybe it's not going to be perfect, but it's like, come on. This right here, this situation, you're putting up lights in your bedroom. If you don't like it, you can take them down. Stop stressing so much. I went through kind of a similar thing with putting up the sound panels. It's like, I don't know what designs. I only have, I only had like 30 panels and they're kind of like a foot by a foot. So I couldn't cover my entire wall. So I, had to, I prioritized and put them where they needed to go at the first reflections is what it's called, so where a sound wave might hit a wall and then bounce to your ears. So I covered that, and then I still had 10 to 12 left over. And I didn't know where to, I didn't like know what kind of designs I wanted, or which ways I wanted to angle them. But, oh well, you know, just do it. Just put them up. If it's not what, what you want, then just take them down and fix it. I go through a lot of anxiety before I do something big like that, like designing my room. Once I know what I want to do and I'm, I, I have the plan, I see it in my head, like there's no, there's no problem, there's no question. But if I'm not there yet, it's tough. I'm sure you guys go through it with your own things. Um, some kids over there doing exercises, doing frog jumps. Let's see, what else I want to tell you about? So trying to get my life and my room and everything up to speed, what I want. So yeah, designing all that stuff, designing my room basically. We're gonna pause here and talk for a second, cause why not? Got some good lighting, it's probably too bright. Maybe we'll sit down on the curb. My neighbors must think I look so weird. That's okay. So. Getting my life up to speed. And I feel like I'm 90% on the way there. I just have like a couple straggler kind of things. I completely redesigned my room the other weekend. When was that? It must have been right after my birthday when I couldn't do anything else because I was so tired and messed up. So I got everything. I got my new, I got my piano in a new position. I got my bed in a new position. That was a couple weeks ago I put that there. I got my desk in a new spot. I got the sound paneling up. I've got uh, something else. Oh yeah, I got the whiteboards up on the wall. I've got lots of whiteboards now. I'm a big fan of writing stuff down and making lists and then being able to erase it. I need to, I need to clean up my desk. Another thing is that I keep jumping around. I want to set up a schedule for myself and I'm almost there. I got it about 60% of the way planned and settled. And uh, part of the problem is that because I run three different categories of things, I tend to jump around between the different categories. I'll work on some music stuff, or I'll, yeah, I'll practice a song or listen to a lot of songs and figure out what I want to do. And then I'll go work on a comedy video and edit that, and then I'll go play some video games. But like, meanwhile, I'm missing out on the minor details. So, for example, I don't have my P.O. Box, my new current P.O. Box address anywhere. And I should have that somewhere, you know? Like, if, uh... I used to have it at the end of every video. But I also was doing more with it back then. But, you know, that's something I should figure out. Where am I, where do I put it? Do I put it in the description box of even my gaming videos? Is it just my music videos? Is it in the channel descriptions, not the video descriptions? You know, that's... I gotta figure that out. Gaming stuff, I need to like... I need to change my intro and outro. I need to make it a little bit more interesting. Maybe I need to just make it an outro. You know, maybe it's... Maybe as having it twice is too much. I don't know. My comedy stuff, I, I just put up a video today. I don't have a... Uh, an intro or an outro on it at all. Just starts and ends with me. Probably starting with just me is fine, but I need to have some kind of like end slate to point people towards other videos. And you know, I gotta, I gotta figure that out. But I don't have, I just hop around without focusing on the details. And right now that's how it's gotta be. We're in a very phase one of this new thing, this new schedule. I think I've done really well for the first month. But, uh, you know, when we get into March, which is in a couple days, we're going to move it on to phase two. You know, I can't, uh, can't keep just clunking along, 
you got to really hunker down and, and do it. <clears throat> so, yeah. So anyways, we're almost there. We're almost there. Uh, setting up a schedule for myself. I haven't gone and exercised much very recently, past week or so. I need to do that more. I went to yoga on Monday, but I need to do strength and cardio as well. I can't just do stretching. So I'm going to think I'm going to start getting up and going running again in the morning. I used to do that when I first left my job. I was doing that pretty regularly. I think that's a really good way to start your day. Get outside. Get your blood going. Get awake. You know? If you guys, you guys out there, you should try and get some kind of exercise in your days. Whether it's walking around the block, going for a jog, going to the gym, doing some yoga, bicycling, skateboarding, climbing a tree. It's a giant tree right above me. You know, whatever it is, just try and get some exercise. I have not been doing that enough. It completely changes your entire day once you get some exercise. You push yourself too hard, it'll make you really tired. But it might also make you feel... Puts things, puts things in perspective. My hair is ridiculous. Puts things in perspective. Makes you feel less stressed out about small stuff. Which is probably why I am feeling so stressed about the small stuff right now, as I haven't been exercising. Aha! A clue! Let's see, I wanted to tell you about... <laughs> I got an early copy of Tomb Raider. I've had it for about two days now. I think I'm about to go in and start playing it now. I'm going to an event with Olga tonight. She keeps inviting me to these cool events. She's awesome. She's like taking me under her wing and like teaching me everything and introducing me to people. She's pretty cool. So we're going to go to this event tonight with a lot of new media people, folks, whatnot, and get to meet some people from... I don't even know. I don't even know all the places. I, know, I think like Fox is gonna be there, and I think some machinima people. There's, there's like there's like ten companies. I think some also some Hollywood agents. And uh, I'm just gonna go meet people. I don't have any high expectations for anything. Cause I'm just not there yet, you know. But we're getting there. We're getting there. And yeah, let's walk this way. Why not? I'm just kind of circling the block right now. Um, what else did I want to tell you about? Need a haircut. Got so much bedhead from today. Need a haircut. Man, that's a bright light right there. Stay in the shade. Okay, I'm going to cut it here. This has, been, this has been long enough. I was going to answer some questions for y'all today, but I ended up just going off on tangents. I even brought... I got all the questions written down. This is not the... This is not the questions. That's my subway receipt. But this other piece of paper in my pocket is... Ha! Got all your questions written down. Oh, yeah, I know what I wanted to tell you. I wanted to tell you that I will be putting up old vlogs that I have recorded in previous years and never got the chance to put them up. So I'm going to call those the lost episodes and I'm going to try and upload those a couple times a week on this channel. They're just from old adventures that I've had and I want to share with you because they're, they're there. I have them. Might as well. I don't want to just overwhelm either so I'll just put them up like a couple days a week. So you'll see those starting to come out soon. And I've got some old gaming videos to catch up on. Uh, I'm going to first do Tomb Raider. And then I'm going to finish up Far Cry 3. And then I'm going to start putting up these old videos that I have. I have like old videos still to upload from Legend of Zelda, from Mass Effect, from... Oh, what was that game? Nevermind. It was like an indie game. And some other stuff. So... 
finding the time to sit down and do that. I think I need to take care of my environment first. That's what I've found is best. It's taking care of your environment, where you live, getting yourself a roof, a proper room, food and water, and then taking care of your projects. So you gotta have the right, you gotta come from the right place in order to get the right things done. That's what I've found. So that's what I'm trying to finish up and do, getting my room set up. So anyways, Hope you guys have a great day. Today is Wednesday, middle of the week. I'm gonna try and upload my comedy videos on Wednesdays. I think that gives me enough time to recover from the weekends and edit and then upload. So let me know what you think about that, all right? Okay, I will hopefully try to answer your questions tomorrow. I got them all written down. One of my things today was to write down all your questions, so. Okay. Lunchtime, that's when I record. We're gonna do this. Get into a schedule, okay? Alright. See you guys later. Have a great night. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.